From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good evening, State College. I'm student meteorologist Patrick Wright here with your CNET forecast. And the clouds are slowly moving in, albeit mainly high clouds right now beginning to filter some of the sunshine. Mixed of sun and clouds today, but 34 degrees as you step outside. And it is going to be cooling off significantly tonight, feeling like 30 degrees as you walk out the door with that north-northwest wind at 5 miles an hour. So what can we expect around the rest of the state? 33 here in Altoona, 34 in State College, 36 up in Williamsport, 42 will be the warm spot in Philadelphia, and 26 will be the cold spot over in Bradford, and that is the spread of our temperatures around most of the state. Now, in terms of our satellite and radar, we have a few clouds moving in here in State College. Otherwise, not much going on right now. Just a few lake effect snow showers towards the northern portion of the state, mainly still keeping themselves mainly in the New York portion of our country. However, things will begin to change tonight. 27 degrees for a low increasing clouds with a calm wind though. So you will want to bundle up tonight because it is going to get a little chilly. Now by tomorrow, that is when the big change occurs. 33 degrees for the high, a wintry mess for most of the region. So any Thanksgiving travel plans, well, you're going to have to change them because this is going to be expect to be a little bit of a mess tomorrow, especially for travel. That is something we are paying attention to as we move on. So let's break it down for you. For ten, by to 9 p.m. tonight, we do expect a few clouds to move into the area. However, not much going on. Again, just a cold, clear night as, you, as we've seen for the last couple of nights. However, moving this forward, things begin to change tomorrow morning. Around 10 a.m., the snow begins to move into our area. Now, this is going to be the challenging part of the forecast. The more snow we get will depend on the temperatures in the atmosphere. Tomorrow morning, though, early afternoon, we do expect more, mainly snow for most of the State College area and Center County region. However, things do begin to change as we head throughout the evening into the late afternoon and early evening hours. By about 10.30 p.m., mainly snow here in Center County. However, that is going to depend on the temperatures at that time at different levels of the atmosphere. Just a slight change can push us over into more sleet or more snow, again, depending on those temperatures. But moving this forward through Friday morning, we do expect mainly snow for the State College area, so we are sandwiched in the snow when the storm moves in and out. However, by Friday afternoon, we are relatively clear for most of the area, just a few clouds hanging around. So if you can travel, if you need, if you do need to travel for Thanksgiving break, just wait till Friday afternoon. That'll be the best time to do it. So what can we expect in terms of our snow totals? This is just snow, not including the sleet, and will depend on our temperatures tomorrow. But for now, we are expecting two to five inches here in the State College area, five to seven inches further north, but a coating to two inches towards Philly and Pittsburgh and the western portion of the state. So what can we expect in terms of our seven-day forecast? Things do calm down, though, after the wintry mess Thursday and Friday. Saturday and Sunday, mainly clear, partly cloudy, both Saturday. A few more clouds on Sunday, 42 degrees on Saturday. Cooling off to 36, though, by Sunday. But then the rest of the week, Thanksgiving week kicks off with a dry, albeit cool week. Temperatures in the mid to upper 30s except for Wednesday, getting back into 42 as we head into Thanksgiving Day on Thursday. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm student meteorologist Patrick Wright. Make it a great day, everybody.